So what is going on guys? Welcome to another Garden Warfare 2 video. Today is episode 2 of my Ability Comparison series. This is the series where every Thursday at 5 o'clock in the UK, you're going to get me breaking down the abilities for one specific character. Last week we took a look at Colonel Con and his Butter Barrage and Bigger Better Butter. If you want to go check that out, I will leave the link down in the description. Make sure you do go check it out if you haven't already. And make sure you do tune in every Thursday at 5 o'clock in the UK to see a brand new video like today. Now today we are going to be taking a look at Super Brains and these Ultra Balls. We have the Super Ultra Ball ability and we also have the Super Multi Ball ability which you can unlock in the Deluxe Edition. If you've already got Garden Warfare 2 and don't have the Deluxe Edition but want to upgrade to the Deluxe Edition, head over to the mailbox. You can pay a small fee of about $10. You will get two unique abilities. You get the Super Multi Ball and also the Bigger Better Butter. You will also get two unique customizations for Super Brains and Colonel Corn. You will be guaranteed the custom emojis and and also the Z7 Mech Imp, if you did not pre-order the game at launch, you will still get them in the Deluxe Edition as well. You'll get a character pack and you will also get 200 thousand coins so if you want to upgrade to the deluxe edition and get these extra features head over to the mailbox pay a small fee of ten dollars and then you will be able to upgrade but anyway let us get straight into today's video comparing the super ultra ball and the super multi ball so first off let us take a look at the differences between these two abilities now with the super ultra ball super brains will hurl a giant massive ball at the enemy it will do one giant explosion and do a huge amount of damage so that is the super ultra ball now with the super multi ball he will fire three smaller explosive balls towards the enemy one after the other one so we just take a little bit longer to fire all three of them they will do a small amount of damage but just remember he is firing three of them so you are going to be able to damage them three times so that is the difference between the two abilities what we're going to be doing is we're going to be breaking them down we're going to be splitting them up i'm going to be showing the positives and negatives of each ability and then giving my overall opinion of which one i do prefer so let's take a look at the recharging rate of these abilities what i mean by this is once you've used the ability you have to wait a certain amount of time before you can use this ability again so what we're going to be doing is we're going to be comparing how long each one of these abilities takes now the super ultra ball will take 17 seconds to recharge before you can use it again whereas the super multi ball will take 18 seconds so there is a difference between how long it takes for the abilities to recharge it is only a second but it can make a difference in the game so that's one thing to keep in mind the multi ball will take one second longer to recharge before you can use the ability again so keep that in mind next let's take a look at the damage that these two abilities do on average they do between 90 and 100 damage provided that you hit every single ball on target directly at the enemy now this is going to be less if you hit them at the side because you do do splash damage it's just not as much so you want to directly hit the plants to do the most amount of damage now the hard decision about these two abilities is weighing up which one to use in which situation because keep in mind if you want to do the most amount of damage with these abilities you're going to need to hit them directly now with the super ultra ball you've only got one ball so you have one chance to hit them directly to do the most amount of damage if you miss and you hit them at the side you're going to do less damage than if you do hit them directly now on the other hand with the super multi ball you can afford to miss one of the balls hitting them directly and if you manage to get the other two hitting them directly you're still going to do a majority of damage to the plant so you can kind of afford to be less accurate with the super multi ball now on the other sense as well is that if you do hit them directly with the ultra ball you're going to do a lot of damage so in my sense, it depends on how accurate you are as a player. If you're a very accurate player and you can kind of predict where the plants are going, I would definitely go for the Ultra Ball because, in my opinion, it does a really good amount of damage. Now, if you are not as accurate, maybe go for the Multi Ball. The reason for that is because if they're moving, it's going to be easier to try and trace where they're going. Also, if there's multiple enemies around, it may be good to do the Multi Ball as well because you're going to do a splash damage on a majority of the plants around you. But I, I honestly don't know which one is better it all depends on which situation you are in but personally myself I would prefer to use the multi ball just because I'm not the best accurate person with the super brains ultra ball ability itself it's very hard to aim directly because of the reticle it's not exactly directly centered like a dot of where it's directly going to go it can kind of disappear and maybe go off in the distance if you are doing it from a distance but it depends how you play your super brains character as well if you like to stay back 
and use your laser, it may be better to use the multi ball because you're going to have a better chance of hitting them uh, with multiple balls uh, being fired. If you like to go right up in the plant's face, it's going to be a lot easier for you to hit them directly. So maybe that's when you want to use the ultra ball. So uh, yeah, there we go, guys. That is my comparison between these two abilities. Keep in mind that the ultra ball will recharge one second quicker than the multi ball. Uh, but what do you guys think about these abilities? Let me know in the comments down below which one you prefer. And also leave a comment down below of what character abilities you would like me to compare next week. But anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching this video. If you did enjoy it, make sure you do leave a like down below because it does show me that you do enjoy this brand new series and that you do want to see more. And uh, it just shows your support for the channel. So anyway, guys, thank you very much for watching. My name is Xerix Fusions and hopefully I'll catch you guys next time. Thank you.